So in today's starting lineup, we've got myself in goal, Joe and Tom at the back. We've got Frank in the midfield and our new signing, Fred, up front. On the bench, we've got Hunter and Harry, and today we're playing a team called Soul Town. Yes, guys, so welcome back to another Wednesday, another goals episode. This is our second game in the championship. We're against a team called Soul Town, who you saw in the lineup. Today, we've got our new side in Freddie Nice playing up front for us. We've got Tom making a return. You haven't seen him in a couple of games. And you've got myself in goal once again, putting in the shift for the boys. Hopefully, we can get our first win in the championship, as we did lose our first game 4 3 against Sagrove. But I'm optimistic that we're going to win this game, and let's get into it. Frank comes close with our first chance of the day. After making the first save of the day, it falls to Frank who plays it over to Tom on this right hand side. Looks like he's going to shoot, tries to pass it to Fred, just gets tackled but he's going to work his arse off to get back and try and win this ball here. It gets um, intercepted by Frank and Freddy Nice on the counter attack, lays it off to the right hand side and this is a quality finish. With the ball played out to this geezer in the Man United shirt, he plays it to number 10, he's going to flick it around to the right hand side and that is a decent finish to be fair. I did call back post but no one reacted in time. Do you guys remember when I titled the video he's a changed man? You didn't really believe it, but are you believing it now? Keeper rolls it to this number 10 on the left hand side. He's going to try and find his mate in the Man United shirt. Great interception from Tom. One on one with the keeper. Fred ain't going to miss from there. Lovely finish. Save! After a great save from their keeper, I'm going to pass the ball out to Frank here, who's going to get fouled, manages to find it to Fred. Fred's going to send this geezer a train ticket to Liverpool, then sends this geezer a train ticket to Bournemouth, but the keeper refunds it. So after a quick save, I'm going to punch the ball out to Frank here, he's going to put it onto his right foot. He hits the post twice, but his follows up and gets the rebound. Classic schoolboy rule, always follow up your shots. To the right! <laughs> Great football from the boys, unlucky to not score there. I'm going to play the ball to Tom, he ain't been here in a while lads. You've got to let him off, he's passed it straight back to me and it's a free kick to the other team. This is another controversial one. As you can see, the ref there is talking to Joe and then the geezer just hits it, but the ref gives it and you can't argue with the ref. That is what it is. It's another one of them weeks. Tom ain't happy. So the ball in the corner here, this guy's going to pass it over. I managed to get my leg there just in time before he could go in. Play it out to Fred here, he's going to drive forward, plays it into Frank. Just can't pull the one two off. He's going to fall back to this Man United shirt, plays it to five. He's going to give him to this guy. He's on the half volley, and that is my first decent save. Free kick falling straight into the feet of Fred. He's going to beat this geezer here. Turns him inside out twice and that's another great save from the keeper. With the ball out on this right hand side here with Tom once again. Skips past this geezer. Has a shot. Test the keeper once. Was that out of the area? I'll leave a comment down below. He's going to fall back to him though. Has another shot. Just going to get blocked. He passes it back to the keeper. Plays it out to the right hand side here. It goes over. Fred just can't put his foot on it. Falls to Man United. Shot is going to cut back. Tom's going to have a good battle with him to see who gets the ball. His mate comes and collects it and Fred forgets the rules. Little double substitution, George and Harry on, Fred and Frank off. 
Rob, are you still with us? So the keeper rolls the ball out to this geezer on the left-hand side who plays it down the line into this geezer and tries to get across full straight into George Hunter. He beats this geezer like he's not even there, comes close hitting the post. Harry with the ball straight into this number 10 here, puts on his right foot. I have to make the best save of the day. We've got to get a cheeky little replay on that one. Tommy will have, Tommy will have. Tom misses his first chance. He don't need another one. Yes! Two world-class saves from the keeper. I don't know how he kept them out. To be fair, this keeper was the best player on their team by far. He kept him in it. It should have been, what, 19-something, but he kept him in it. Man United from the right-hand side has a shot, falls out. Harry just can't get it to Tom, and they manage to score. It's a free kick given to them somehow, but has a shot. It falls to George Hunter, one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. Another excellent save from the keeper and another one. But again, I think that could have been out of the area, but Harry earns the foul. Don't even ask me how they scored that. Me with the ball out to Harry, he's going to send this geezer to Asda, come close with his left foot hitting the post. If someone wants to count how many times we hit the post in this video and leave a comment down below, feel free. On, so coming close to half time, this geezer is going to flick it over. Number five was meant to touch it down, which put Joe off, which means Man United is going to come through, has a shot, puts it into the side Boy. netting, and that is going to be half time. We was winning about 6-2, but now it's 6-5. Let's see what the boys got to say about it. Comments? 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 Possibly. What? 6-5, but we were like, I don't know what we were like, like 6-2 or something? Yeah. Silly mistakes. Make the subs. No, Bring the boys back on. I'm off for 10. Off for 10? Who else is off? Frank and Fred, back on. Comments? Bruv, we're just, I don't know, we're better than them and we're just making stupid mistakes. We're giving them too much respect. Yeah. Tom's got words for the management. Yeah, I don't even know why you bring that kid off. That is such a stupid move. Who else? I don't care about minutes. It's the best team that makes. So coming back out of half time with a 6-5 lead, Fred on the ball here does well to keep it, plays a 1-2 with George and we're unlucky not to score. So Man United in this corner again, Fred and Frank both teaming up trying to get the ball. Frank takes one straight to the draw, they take the free kick early, have to make a decent save. Me with the ball here, I'm going to play it out over to Frank on this left hand side, plays it into George Hunter's feet. Does well, skips it over to Fred, nice movement there into George Hunter and that's a decent finish. So the ball flicked over here, that's a great interception from Frank, straight on his right foot again, decent save from the keeper. So with the ball into Fred, this is what he brings to the team. With the ball out to George Hunter, he's going to flick it over to Frank, he does well to keep this ball in play, he plays it into George Hunter, he's going to cut it back to Fred, decent shot, decent save from the keeper. So the keeper with the ball is going to roll it out to this geezer on the left hand side, that is a good tackle from Tom Frank, going to play the ball early to Fred, he's going to drive here, acts like he's going to pass it to George, puts it on his right foot, great finish.
So Fred with the ball in this corner once again does well to make it out of the corner. Falls to George Hunter who hits the post once again. It's going to come out to Frank who wins it here. Going to play it into Fred. Decent back heel. George Hunter just can't implement the finish. Going to fall back to Tom. Skies it. That's unlucky from the boys. So Fred going to pass the ball to George, just a bit too in front of him, does well to get his foot there, pulls it back to his left foot and that's a brilliant finish into his bottom left hand corner. Frank jockeying this geezer really well there, he's going to make a good tackle, he's going to force him backwards, try to go down the line but Frank ain't letting him do that. Um, comes inside here, plays it over. That's a brilliant interception from George Hunter. He's going to drive down. That's a handball. Ref lets us play on Fred. Nice on his right foot again. Round the keeper for the second time. That's what you love to see. Let's go. Five foot three. English. On your head, Max. Save Rob. Good flick from Fred over George Hunter. He's going to hit the post. That's unfortunate. All our players are forward except from Joe. Man United has a shot into the bottom right hand corner. I ain't getting down there. So with a free kick here in our half on this left hand side, he's going to play it to George Hunter. Plays it over to Joe. Um, he's going to go line into Fred. Um, does well to hold off this geezer and beat him down the line. Lays it into Harry and that's a brilliant finish. Great football from the boys. To be fair, this is great football. Max ain't time, happy. Time, time. Come on. I said time. Cool time for. So what you're about to see in a second is another controversial decision from the ref and basically just watch what happens here and you'll see. As you can see here, his foot clearly is all in the area and he takes the ball out and then goes to score. I nearly save it. Some things just don't need commentary. <laughs> These are the reactions from the lads. So with the boys pushing to get a chair on the ice in, as the score is 11-10 at the moment, it's going to come to Fred, he's going to beat this man, get a cheeky nutmeg on this one, as a shot just gets blocked, it falls out to the skeezer, there's one on one with me, and he does score to be fair. So the ball played out to Tom, he's going to beat one man here, um, the shot just gets deflected, he's going to fall to Frank, does well with his knowledge to pass the ball back to Fred, slots it into the bottom right hand corner, who could have potentially scored the winning goal. After Joe making another great block, he's going to smash this down the line and this is going to be the final score. The finishing score was 12-11. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure you guys smash like button, subscribe and I'll see you next week. Arthur J out. First game back, two goals. Two blocks, last minute of the game. To be honest, mate, we didn't play well, but two deflections off of me for the last... Um, Few goals. Was that a on goal in that corner down there? Me? Yeah. It went under his foot. Still your pass though. Rob, that was poor. What happened there? I lost my head because that was in the area and I just wasn't concentrating. And that literally it. I was talking to Lemna over there as well. Yeah, their second to last goal was in the area. We all know that.
But we play on.